Ernie? <gasps> oh no! You startled me! Now how are you gonna get out of here? I know a way! So, Doc, any news? We know zilch. Really? I got the whole alien probing in the sewers treatment for z zilch Well, that is not entirely true. We don't know where you are from. But we do know you have a lot of multiversal radiation. Radiation? What does that mean? It means you probably traveled a lot through the multiverse. But I only traveled to this Earth. Or... Yes? Or you come from a central point in the multiverse! We checked against the radiation signature of Earth Prime. It didn't match. We will need to do more tests! Maybe even more universe hopping to get samples! Where is your Mexican friend? What do you mean? You know, the Mexican. He is not Mexican. Yeah, he's Cuban, bro. Cuba? I thought he was from Spain. Nah, he looks too Mexican to be from Spain. Ay, ay, ay. What does that even mean? Ernie is not Latino, nor Hispanic. He is Asian! <laughs> <laughs> or he is not Chinese! <laughs> Maybe Native American? I don't think he is Native American. I don't care where on earth he came from! Why isn't he here? Since Chirel is not in the building right now, I was going to destroy the sword. And why did you want to destroy the sword? That is why you need to destroy the sword of Tengu. Without it, he relies only on his body armor. If you do that, you will be greatly recompensed. I can finally get what I want? Indeed. <laughs> And that is how I was able to finally quit the clan. Well, it's just that, you know, the Baxters are planning on getting rid of Cherell, so I did my part. That means the Baxters will take care of Cherell after all. Interesting. If Cherell is not there, maybe we should get in again and surprise him and the Baxters. Uh, I, I should really get rid of this sword before seeing Baxter again. I shouldn't go back just yet. It's okay. Take this sword to the rooftop of the Chester Toys building. Someone will meet you there. She will take it away safely. On my way. Any change of plans, Professor? I think the Baxter's plan fits very well with our intentions tonight. But we certainly don't want to see Baxter leading their clan. He still has the technology to make an alliance with the Krang. Yeah, I can see it getting out of control. It also doesn't seem like they will keep him alive. And we do need Jarell alive to prove we fixed this mess. This will sound horrible, but... Dude, if you have to say something will sound horrible, I am hurt. <laughs> what is it? I mean... Even if Jarrell dies, you can take his body as evidence. No, no one should die tonight. And since Jarrell is not in the building, let's go ahead and take Krang from the dungeons. That shouldn't be too hard. I am here to free you, Master. Excellent. Hey, kid! What are you waiting for? Free me! It's an order! 
I'm sorry. I am such a Luddite. I don't know how to open your stupid cell. What? You are still mad about that comment? Come on! I was a little frustrated that day. How about a promotion, huh? Wanna be my elite? Weren't you crazy for a promotion? Something is off here! Something is off, all right. JC? No! We need Krang alive! Where's she now? I thought she was waiting for me. Ernie, right? I understand what you're going through. I know how crazy it is to be loyal to your clan. But you must never be afraid of fighting back for your principles. Rebel and find your own path. Don't let anyone tell you how to live your life. I left you a turtle com. If you get in trouble and you need some help, give me a buzz and I will be right there. Jenica. Jenica? Wow. What a nice name. Jenica. I wonder if she's tall. No one expects the Baxter's Inquisition. Sorry, I had to say it. Wait, what are you doing here? You piece of scum! You absolute trash of a person! You despicable vermin! Whoa, don't pitch a hissy fit on me, buddy. I was just following orders. Oh, yeah? Before Deathstroke became your leader, you were... Following orders? You would have done the same thing. Uh, no, I literally did the opposite. It's a Terminator! Hang on, calm down. Baxter is alive, just not here. You have nothing to fear. Except for that Baxter. He'll get zapped too. What is going on here? What? Hey, where did Crane go? Further than you? That was impeccable timing, Crane. All right, free me so I can finish off the reptile. Crying? Crying? Oh, so that is how the cookie crumbles now. You know what, Crying? I rule the day I freed you from the dimensional limbo. This partnership is over! I will get out of here and go back to my Earth to take care of things more effectively without you dragging me down. Oh, I am dragging you down. Me? Where would you be right now without my help? You guessed it. Behind bars. So save yourself a round trip and stay there. Did you hear that? It sounded like an explosion. Um... Dude, we already have the Dimensional Gateway. Let's get out of here. No! What if something went wrong with Krang? If something went wrong with Krang, then things are going more than well. Come on, guys! Run! Don't stop! What? Why?
that is why. Come on, run. JC? Is he... He's just unconscious. We need to take JC away from here. Come on. I think there's too much going on right now. Yeah, we should leave right now. I am not going anywhere. But... Professor... I am tired of running. We came here to get two Utroms, and my hands are peculiarly empty at the moment. We'll stay with you, Professor. Wait a minute, please. I came here to collect two live Utroms. I have no intentions of interfering with whatever your plans are. Just hand over your Ultrons and we will leave. Take him. Where did you come from? I went after Baxter, thinking he was up to no good. And that is when I saw him picking up a dimensional gateway and leaving with the Shredder from Earth-87. What about Krang? No signs of him. I checked. He probably escaped. Such an intriguing development. If the dimensional gateway is in, I assume, Earth-87 right now, then Krang no longer has access to the dimensional hopping technology. I don't think there's a reason for you and your Salmonella carrying friends to be here anymore. Of course. Thank you for your help. Maybe I should make friends with a little robot to help me find out where I come from. Speaking of finding out where people are from... What's up, buddy? I cannot believe... All the rumors about our Shredder hulking out were true. Even his clothes, they mutate with him. How does that even work? So, we were wondering earlier... Uh-huh? Where are you from, exactly? Oh, well, I'm from Queens. Yeah, but like, uh, more originally, Earth-90. But your home will always be in... Oh. Oh, I, I didn't get your question before, sorry. It's okay, bro. So, uh, you're really from... Flushing. Yeah. Yeah. Flushing. That's, uh... Yeah, that's what yeah. we thought, yeah. <laughs> Those fools are not aware that I made Baxter make a second dimensional gateway for me. We will make sure that no Shredder from no Earth puts a stop to my plans ever again. And because of Deathstroke and Trell, I just inherited the New York Criminal Underground! I am under the impression that there is going to be a lot of soliloquies around here from now on. Wanted 
to see me, Master? Yes, Ernie Reyes. You did exactly what I asked you, and you did it very well. You have earned your promotion. Promotion? Oh, right. The... The arrangement we had. Yes. Oh, yes. Ha <laughs> ha. I I wasn't sure what the arrangement was. I I don't know. Maybe it was something crazy like uh, letting me retire early. <laughs> <laughs> no. Here in the Foot Clan, we only retire in a coffin. Congratulations, Elite. Ha <laughs> ha These are tears of Joy, just so you know. <laughs> where, where did I put that hanky? Bruce, I had a horrible dream. Really? Yes. But you weren't you. You were a big shredder. And Chet was beige, with red gloves, and had a brain in his stomach. I think he hurt his friend. And you killed my brother! Ah, uh, here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> 